morning guys and welcome back to the channel as you can see it is super cold with some frost on those roofs over there but sun hasn't sun hasn't come up all the way it's just before eight o'clock and probably like 40 degrees but i think i'm a little crazy trying to go fishing right now but oh man i've just been seeing a ton of reports of people catching a ton of trout redfish right now and i just got the itch to get out there so i'm gonna take the morning probably till like noon i think it's supposed to get cloudy around noon so we us take some clear skies and uh chilly morning see what we can do see you guys out there All right guys, I cast up in that creek right there. I feel like I got a little trout on. Yeah, all right, I finally found one. Okay. All right, so I've been coming down this creek here, just kind of floating down, cast right into the mouth of that creek right there. And that trout is just waiting for bait to kind of come into this creek. A little small guy, but got the skunk off the boat. Look how beautiful that fish is. Let him go. All right, so it's been a tough morning. There's a couple creeks back that I kind of went back all the way, you know, hundreds of yards back in them. Like that creek right there will probably go back, you know, three, 400 yards, maybe. Um, it's a cold morning. There was ice on the roofs this morning. Like I'm wearing gloves, which I don't usually fish when I'm wearing gloves. In Charleston, this is pretty cold weather for us. Um, so. I've actually never even fished this creek before and I got this boat about a year ago and I got a car to pull, a truck to pull it about two months ago. So I've been getting out on the boat a lot more. I used to kayak fish a ton, uh, but I don't really ever fish water this big from a kayak. I mean, sometimes I do, but I'm usually in small creeks. So I'm just getting used to like finding new territory, uh, you know, and, and being able to read the water. And I've just kind of been hitting uh, streams of current. I've been hitting uh, creek mouths. Uh, I'm gonna go back and put my stick pin in real quick and try to fish that mouth again and see if there's one, one or two more fish. All right, I'm pulling this creek here. This creek the other day, I caught a really nice red on maybe two weeks ago. And there was a school of them in here. So I'm hoping that they have essentially stayed in here. I think I'm just gonna hang back, kind of cast in the, kind of just keep casting my way into the creek if that makes sense. I'm not trying to bulldoze my way in there. cast in here. Yeah. Oop. 
dropped him. But caught him on this right here. I strike weedless, gold sparkle. Oh. This little baby trout. I know there's an oyster mound basically right where my bait just dropped. Kind of goes down into a little pool. That's where that trout hit just a minute ago. This little creek right here will hold some reds. Oh, you're right. 